Hello everyone. Uh, so this is a follow-up video for the uh, Forza Horizon 4 video that I made. Now, uh, thank you for everyone who watched, and it's good to see that it's worked out for some people. But some of you are still having issues. Um, so there's a couple things we're going to address. Now, the first one is some of you actually can't even find the GP Edit in your Start menu. Now, the first thing you can do uh, if you can't find gpedit.msc from your start menu, just like this, have a quick double check in your system32 uh, file because it could be lurking in there. So you can do that by going to your boot drive, Windows, system32, and then see if uh, gpedit is in there. If it's not, you're just going to have to enable it. So I'll put this link in the description, but this is where you want to come to. You can literally find this by search Googling uh, enable GP edit, and it's the first, uh, literally the first uh, link there. And you want to scroll down a bit, and this is the link you want to hit. Obviously, I don't need to do that because I already have it. Uh, so that's the first issue. Uh, oh, quickly, I'll say if this still doesn't work, if this still doesn't uh, get your GP edit up, then I'm afraid you might have to contact Microsoft for that. Now, you obviously, you don't need to call them. You can get a uh, get help by searching get, and then get help should be here. And then that, sh that will put you through to uh, a Microsoft uh, guy or woman. And they'll uh, hopefully be able to help you out. So, um, it might be something to do with the actual Windows 10 installation. And at that point, that's kind of out of my hands. Uh, okay, so that's the first thing. The other thing is some of you have done this, but then when you uh, go to your Xbox network pin, it's still saying that the NAT type is strict and the server connectivity is blocked. Uh, there's one thing you can try uh, to solve that uh, is you go to right click down here to, on your internet, right click, uh, open and open network and internet settings. Then that this comes up, you're going to hit change adapter options. Now I'm using the Ethernet one, so whichever one you're connected to, go ahead and right click that and then properties. And basically, you want to double click Internet Protocol version 4. You double click that, and by default, it would be on obtain an IP address automatically and obtain DNS server automatically. Um, what you will need to do is basically use the following DNS server addresses. Uh, so this is Google's uh, public one. So if it's on here, go ahead and do that. And then on the preferred DNS, you want to hit 8888. And then on the alternative DNS, 8844. This is Google's uh, public uh, DNS uh, server. And uh, this should fix the issue for you if you still have a strict uh, NAT type. So. Give that a go. Now, the last thing, uh, to, you know, the last thing you can try doing or having a look up on, if you're still having a strict NAT type, is your firewall. It could be a firewall issue. So, from the start menu, go ahead and search Fire, and you want to find Windows Defender Firewall, and this comes up. Now, we want to go on to, to allow an app or feature through Windows Defender. Firewall, go ahead and click that, and everything's grayed out. So you basically just want to hit change settings and then it'll come up. Basically, find Forza, find Forza Horizon 4, and make sure both the private and the public are ticked. Once that's done, you can go ahead and hit OK, and it'll save it. Don't need to hit apply or anything, you should just do it like normal. Uh, and uh, you know, so it's safe to again, once you do all these methods, give your uh, PC a restart, and that hopefully should fix the issue for you. All right. Well, uh, if it's still, if any of this still doesn't have uh, any effect, um, please, please do leave a uh, comment saying what issues you've run into if it's still not working. Um, and I'll see, I'll see what I can basically find. Um, the only reason I made the first video uh, is because I didn't actually, the, the, there weren't, wasn't actually a video of a true fix. Um, but I guess you know. This one is still people having issues, so you know I want to I want to help you guys out because hey, Forza is a good game, and I uh, want you guys to be able to play it. All right, cool. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, it's not next one. Hopefully, this just uh, is the end. But 
We'll see what happens. All right.